Hi, I'm Kate Morocco here with Bill Johnson from TCOM. Bill, I understand that you make a lot of use of the publish command and especially with DSD files or drawing set descriptions. Can you tell us uh, how that works? Sure. Um, so when in our projects that we have, and we have one project, and I'll just relate this as a very quick story. Sure. That one project we had had over 600 sheets associated to it. That's now, a lot. if yeah, if, now with the DSD file, we're able to sort them, assign them in the publish dialog box, and also be able then to print them out directly to a PDF. Now that's a great thing. However, in AutoCAD slash AutoCAD MEP, the issue was is that it was opening up each drawing file and while that doesn't sound like a big thing, each drawing was taking like five to ten minutes to open up because we had so many external references attached to each page. So what I did, thinking about it a little bit, was I said, well, it's a DSD file. I can import that into AutoCAD LT Publish. And then I used AutoCAD LT as my publishing workhorse, basically, and I was able to cut down uh, a job that would have normally been several hours into, I basically timed it and it was like a half an hour. And then I was able to use, send that to the PDF that's built in into the new publish for LT 2011 mm -hmm. and have the page set up so I don't have to rotate them. Everything was coming out on the right layers and everything was just, just perfect. And I was able to get those people back to being productive and not worrying about, you know, all the time that was lost prior to that. Uh, just waiting around to see if the published job came out correctly and then having to go in and then rotate the pages before. But okay. now I don't have to. So because a, a DSD file is basically it's a list of sheets in the correct order with the right page size and the right plot styles and all that. So you can then reuse that file later if you need to publish the same sheet set again? Yes, indeed. And um, if uh, I even had one adventurous user uh, go out and even use it in DWG True View, although the results were not as reliable. But I tried it again and it was still reliable. However, the time frame was still not much different than LT. In LT, I was guaranteed 100% um, compatibility. So I was really, really happy and so were the partners. So that's the important thing was saving productivity, saving and uh, saving money. And all so, that with DSD files. All that with DSD and publish. Thanks, Bill. You're welcome.